Preventing and Managing Hip Dysplasia in Pembroke Welsh Corgis Pembroke Welsh Corgis are beloved dogs and known for their adorable appearance and playful personalities. However, like many dog breeds, they may be prone to certain health issues. One common concern among potential owners is whether Pembroke Welsh Corgis are prone to hip dysplasia, a condition that affects the hip joints and can cause pain and mobility issues. In this article, we will explore the prevalence of hip dysplasia in Pembroke Welsh Corgis and provide information on how to prevent and manage this condition. Hip dysplasia is a hereditary condition that primarily affects larger dog breeds. It occurs when the ball and socket joint of the hip do not properly develop, leading to instability and eventual degeneration of the joint. While it is more commonly seen in larger breeds, it can also affect smaller dogs, such as Pembroke Welsh Corgis. To understand the likelihood of Pembroke Welsh Corgis developing hip dysplasia, it is essential to consider their genetic predisposition. According to studies, Pembroke Welsh Corgis have a moderate prevalence of hip dysplasia, with approximately 15% of individuals being affected. This percentage is significantly lower than that of larger breeds, such as Golden Retrievers or German Shepherds, where up to 50% of dogs may develop the condition. Factors that contribute to the development of hip dysplasia include genetics, environment, and lifestyle. Responsible breeders play a crucial role in reducing the occurrence of hip dysplasia by selectively breeding dogs with good hip scores and avoiding mating individuals with a history of the condition. Regular veterinary checkups are also important to monitor the dog's hip health and address any potential issues at an early stage. While genetics cannot be changed, certain environmental factors can influence the development and progression of hip dysplasia. Ensuring a proper diet and maintaining a healthy weight are vital in managing the condition. Mission. Obesity can exacerbate hip dysplasia symptoms and put additional stress on the joints, worsening the dog's quality of life. Regular exercise is equally essential, but it should be low impact and not strain the hip joints excessively. Symptoms of hip dysplasia in Pembroke Welsh Corgis may vary from mild to severe and can include difficulty rising, lameness, reluctance to jump or climb stairs, decreased activity levels, and noticeable discomfort when touched around the hip area. If you suspect your corgi may be experiencing hip dysplasia, a visit to a veterinarian specializing in orthopedics is recommended. The veterinarian will conduct a thorough examination, including x-rays, to assess the severity of the condition. Treatment options for hip dysplasia in Pembroke Welsh Corgis can range from conservative management to surgical intervention, depending on the severity of the condition. Conservative management may include weight management, physical therapy, and the use of anti-inflammatory medications to alleviate pain and reduce inflammation. Surgical procedures such as total hip replacement or femoral head osteotomy may be necessary for severe cases where conservative management is ineffective. Prevention is always better than treatment when it comes to hip dysplasia. If you are considering adding a Pembroke Welsh Corgi to your family, it is crucial to choose a reputable breeder who prioritizes the health and well-being of their dogs. Requesting hip scores and lineage history can give you insight into the potential risk of hip dysplasia in the puppy. Additionally, providing a balanced diet, regular exercise, and maintaining a healthy weight throughout your dog's life can help reduce the risk of developing hip dysplasia or manage it effectively if it occurs. In conclusion, while Pembroke Welsh Corgis have a moderate prevalence of hip dysplasia, it is lower compared to larger dog breeds. It's genetic predisposition, environmental factors, and lifestyle choices all play a role in the development and management of this condition. By choosing a responsible breeder, maintaining a healthy lifestyle for your corgi, and seeking proper veterinary care, you can minimize the risk of hip dysplasia and ensure a happy, active life for your furry friend.